Is it? They're up. Oh, she closed the other door, Sebby. Oh. <sighs> Fucking... Oh, it's these guys again. This is one of the hardest games you'll ever play. Your patience will be tested. And on top of that, if that wasn't bad enough, the people are toxic. He's teabagging me. Always nice to be teabagged. Hmm. Okay. This is my story. We start off solo, and this was one of my hardest days on Rust. Easter egg hunt. Yes. It's the Easter update, guys. Need to get a basket. So I need to get 10. Upgrade it. Give me a basket. 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 Yes. What do I need? One, two, three, four. By the door. We were off to a great start. I got myself an Easter basket. I got myself enough resources to start with the base. And I found the location I wanted. And on top of that, there was a base that had already been raided I could take over. It's very, very quiet. The server is full, I tell you. Oh my god, I'm a three. TC. Clear auth. I'm going to die of starvation in a second. My door's not crafted yet. <gasps> I'm not going to do it in time. If I died of starvation before I got this door down, I would end up losing everything. Come on, door. Five seconds. Quick, quick, quick. Unlock, pick up. Got it. Oh my god. And I. Oh, just in time. We were off to a great start, as I said. I hadn't died yet, except from starvation, which is fine. And I had a base, and all I needed was a furnace. I needed some low grade. This is. It. Don't do it, man. Man, come on. I'm your neighbor. Neighbor. Alright, he's the target. We have a target. Roof ca Already a roof camper. I'd lost a bit of loot to a roof camper. No big deal. I mean, I like to have a target in a game and he became my target very quickly. And fortunately, I had crude oil farmed already and there was an ore refinery right next to my base. So I went to use that. We're going to be friends. I'm your neighbor. Man, I'm your neighbor. You okay to be friends? Their microphones were really bad, but they were my neighbors on the other side, and we agreed to be friendly with each other, which is useful, especially at such early stage of the game, and I'm on my own, and I'm never going to win a fight against two. So, having a truce was ideal. It didn't take me long at all to get a furnace up and running from this crude oil, and then I was able to craft my metal door and secure my base fully. Any chance you spawned again? Yes, they have. Oh my god, how lucky is that? Even my trip to water treatment plant was fruitful. I got myself a python. Things were looking up and it was going to be a good day on rust. Oh, pickaxe. I need that BP. Yoink. Risk, risk it. Oh. oh, those pickles ruined me. I think eating two bad pickles is a sign that things might start taking a turn for the worse. Crying out loud. Can we be friends? I need that pickaxe. I don't have the BP. I just need that pickaxe or BP, please. So after an hour or so, this was my base. A couple of boxes and a furnace. And it was completely secure, except for the fact it was decaying. But that's no big deal. I mean, I wasn't going to get raided, right? So, yep. Yeah, a couple of K sulfur, a couple of K stone, no wood. So wood was my issue now. Thought we were friends, man. I'm your neighbor. I'm your neighbor. Are you my, you're my neighbors. Are oh, you guys are my neighbors, yeah? My neighbors have stayed true to their word oh. and picked me up. 
Oh, all right, guys. There we have it. Neighbors betrayed me. Boom. And that's Rust in a nutshell. No reason to kill me. Naked, I had nothing. But they decided that they didn't need a truce with me now. Oh, my God. Now things started to go downhill. I really needed wood. And every time, and I mean every time I went to farm it, I got killed. Oh, for fuck's sake. Inbred. Inbred. I'm beginning to get frustrated. Like, literally, this guy just killed me, and then he saw me hit the tree twice, and he came back and killed me again. It's not like I had anything of worth on me yet. At least wait till I farmed a lot. So I was getting, understandably, very frustrated. All right, guys, we need to find where this guy lives. Eleanor. So I thought I'd take a break from my wood farming, and I went to water treatment, and maybe I could get some loot from there. Any crates up there? Can you see? Someone's here. Hey man, I'm just a naked with a hatchet. Can you pick me up, please? I will leave. I take only clothes. Okay, thank you. He was nice. He was picking me up. That, that is not always common in Russ, especially in such a prime area. He puts himself at risk just by picking me up because he's forced to stand still for a while. It's just me, man. It's just me. You okay? You need help? You need help? Oh, hello. Was that aimed at me? I had managed to scavenge some loot and I was on my way home when I heard somebody collecting eggs just outside of water treatment and, well, in true Sebi K-style, I couldn't resist. Ah, oh, there wasn't two of them! I had died one too many times and quite frankly, it's getting boring for stream. Yes, that's right, I do stream. Make sure you check out Twitch, links in the description. And Sora was on the server and he had a little base with a tier two in it. So I decided to move in with him and see how we would fare as a duo. Well, too many people know mine, so, you know, I, I had to improvise. Two small boxes that I love the most. Oh, Easter eggs. I feel better already having this the stuff. Oh yeah, yes. It's absolutely incredible the feeling just working with one more player. You feel so much more secure that, you know, if somebody jumps you, you have someone to back you up or it's a 2v2 at least. You know you know what I mean, It just you feel so much more safe. So as a duo, we went and we went looking for bases that we could take advantage of, whether it's an eco raid or, yeah, going deep. So we went to have a quick look. Oh, yeah. yeah, there's a wood ceiling. Just check out the roof. There's two wooden doors to get in, wood, wood. We've got naked creeping up on us. What do you have? Tools. <coughs> yeah, I got it. Hold on. Um, let me try and boost it, and all you gotta do is keep jumping yeah. on my head, and then. His airlock was a little bit higher than just a uh, normal wall height, so we thought we could hide in the top and place a twig foundation and destroy it when he opened up. That way it would be so much easier to go deep, but this proved very difficult and we weren't able to do it. Let's go. Nope. Yeah. Sometimes you can just tell. This guy was not going to try and make it play, and he was just happy having me trapped in his airlock. But he did have a plan, and he went to get his neighbors next door to help him to kill me. He's coming with a DB. Watch your front door. Okay. Watch your front door. Have him wait until he opens. Ready? Open the door, dude. <laughs> that didn't work out for him, did it? <laughs> no, he got murked. He even knew he was expecting to come and see me and he still got murked. It's yeah, I saw it. Yeah, I saw it. There's a guy in this base down here. One on here. top of the roof. One on the roof. 
He's dead. Put him in the head. Kill the other guy. There's a heli here. I'm being bowed. Oh, there's a shotgun trap. I was deep. Oh, Sammy goes. Fuck me. Every now and then, you do meet nice people in Rust. However, always be Did cautious. Just start Hello. I'm a friend. I'm a friend. Are you friendly? I'm a, I'm a, I'm a nice guy. Do you have a need? Do you have a, uh, what is it called? No, 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 no. Do you have Sabi. a cloth? Wait. I need cloth. Cloth. No, nobody has cloth. Nobody has cloth. Someone shooting us with the freaking bow. Help. Oh, shit. Oh shit, hello. Come in, come in. Thanks. Okay, no one here. You can come with me if you want, man. I'm gonna go check out I'm gonna check out a base. You can come be my look at I'm down quickly oh my god. Fuck's sake. Lost all the ladders. No, just the moment I walk out the base. And this is when things started to go downhill. Ah, oh, behind us. I'm down, there's two of them. My goodness. Really? These weren't just your average Rust players. They had used that horse as a distraction and crept up on us when we came out of the base. Oh my god, there's even the cross. It, uh... Sora is on the roof fighting. Shit, Sebi, can you spawn? I think I made a mistake, guys. By mistake, he means the doors are open. Spawn, yes, I think I can. No, I can't. 75 seconds. Yeah, they're up. Oh, she closed the other door, Sebi. Okay, he's in there, trapped. He is trapped in the worst possible place with the tool cupboard and the main loot. All we do know is there's not enough stuff for him to pick out with, so he's trapped in there for the time being. Well, we have a guy trapped in the base now, do we? What do you want from me? Right, I'm spawning the base. Two, one... I can't do anything, Sora, because the furnaces. I'm glitched. Sora. Oh, no, come back in. Close the roof door. Yeah. He's just opened all of your things. He's opened all the eggs. Are they all gone? Yeah. Yep, they're all, they're not under anymore. Okay, I've lost the Easter eggs. Not the end of the world. Are you ready? I can't. What, what am I gonna do? <laughs> Fucking rock him. Let's just rock him because he's going nowhere else when he gets out of here. He's literally going nowhere else when he gets out of here. Okay. Troll, troll, troll. Can we make a deal? Uh, you you let him out, and uh, uh, we let the people here. No? Well, I don't mind, you know. They're offering a deal. Somehow, I don't think it's legitimate. He's got TC, which is the problem now. It's the same guys over and over. He's despawning everything. Fuck's sake. Yeah. So he either has to despawn everything or die. If he despawns everything, we'll just fucking move. He was despawning our loot. We had to make a play. So all we could get was spears. At least it was a two versus one as long as we could get to the base ourselves. Yeah, but why do you upgrade a wall to metal and turn it around? Come to me now, come to me, come to me, come to me. Hold on, spears. Take that. You get on the roof. Oh no, 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 I can Sword found a bean can, I've got a hatchet, we're gonna go top and bottom attack. Oh, Bing Khan's gonna go off, watch out. Hi. 
Sorry, terrorist. Wow, wow. He, legit, he legitly did. He spawned up everything. Told you he walled off. Yep, he walled off. This is the most toxic of toxic. He walled off our TC and tried to despawn everything. Lucky for us, he's quite stupid. Look at the gunpowder there he left behind. If he really wanted to screw us, he could have put it in the tool cupboard and then walled it off. Not so smart, mate. Thank you very much. We got our loot back. And now he tries to do something else. He just made, he just fucked everything up. He even rotated this so we can't use it. No, we can't. You can rotate it back on you Wow. What? No, I've seen some cunts in my time, but this is like a different level. We can still use it here. We can still use it here. What's your name? Uh, my name is, uh, Tell him we'll give him the thousand gunpowder to destroy the wall. I'll give you the thousand gunpowder to destroy the wall and take the lock off the TC. That's what I'll do. A very reasonable deal in my eyes. Right now, on top of that, they're trying to block us in so we can't even escape with our loot. He had sealed our front door and was trying to get the roof. We had to intervene quickly. You dead? No, no. He came back. I'd given these kids too much credit before. He's coming back with wood. I mean, that is the easiest thing to eco raid. I mean, it's what I do in every video. On my way this is your base? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Our base was lost. A tier two down the drain, but we had the little loot that we had. We moved into Terrace little base and we decided to fight another day. Guys, look out for part two. I hope you enjoyed it. Anyone wants to play with me, we are doing a Zerg event on this Thursday, so make sure you check out my Discord for full information. Have a great day. Yeah, like